All right, so hello and welcome back. So, my sister left today. I'm feeling very strange because she is leaving due to an eye disease that she had. Uh, she's going to be taken care of by my family, by my parents, because here I'm very busy with the studies, with the schooling, with everything like that. Um, yeah, so that's that happened. I try to stay positive, and, and in the same time, I'd like to talk about the things that I'd like to improve for the future. There's a lot of things that you just, a lot of things that take place that you must have the time by yourself to actually work on it. So the very first thing that I wanted to work on is to definitely realize and to be happier. I feel like the vibe that I have, even though I'm very, very happy in some days, my vibe does not match the way I actually feel. I always, I feel like my vibe, I do have a good poker face, I do poker quite well, but I just, my like resting face or resting face is always very, very depressed or very sad, even though I'm not feeling that way. So that is something that I definitely have to improve. Um, just, you know, being or acting even happier, like smiling more um, is very important. Secondly, is being very grateful to God. Everything that I have is from God. And I always say this, I always repeat the statement because it is absolutely true. Don't feel like the need to, um, there's nothing that worrying can do. So there's certain things that I wanted to talk about, about the last few days, is that I've had one of the biggest exams, one of the biggest proficiencies, they call it. So basically they take the students and they see their, um, their performance in front of a doctor in the hospital, um, and to see how you're doing, you know, if you're qualified to be in clinic. So I was really stressed. I couldn't do anything the day before. I feel like that was the most, I've had a lot more stressful or higher stakes things, but I can say that I've never been stressed for anything in my life and, uh, or that much. So what I think is that number one, why are you so stressed? You've already practiced for it. Never ever allow yourself to be that stressed again. Like, just remember, nothing is actually that serious. Nothing is actually that worth it. That you're very stressed to the point that you cannot even think. You cannot even, like, I wasn't even, I couldn't think straight. While being stressed is a normal human tendency, but when it goes out of hand, when you're always, like, stressed, oh my God, what am I going to perform? What am I going to do? That I didn't like about myself. The amount of stress that I have is just outlandish. And you need to start having it as part of your life to the point where you need to like coexist with it. Be able to coexist with stress. That way you're not just always thinking about and somebody's trying to open my door. And I have that very often here. It's just um, I've been having a number of stalkers and they just stalk me back to my place and it's just becoming this, this fear. I keep dreaming about people like wanting to get in. So that's why I need to get another camera to be to hang up uh, on the door, on the outside door. Although I live in a very safe place. Um, so anyways, where was I? So yes, um, something else that I wanted to talk about is most definitely I did not like that about myself. But what I really liked about myself is that by the time it came, regardless of the amount of stress I've had, I was completely, and I sounded completely relaxed and confident. It's because of the amount of practice I had, especially with like public speaking, with all these things. But that was wonderful. I'm just gonna go check who was at the door real quick. It's completely locked, but anyways. Um, yeah, something else that I wanted to talk about. Actually, I'll do it in another video.